Metal leaf is a popular accent in gourd art and is available in colors like gold, copper, silver, and variegated black and red. It is often seen on high dollar gourd art and many well-known gourd artists incorporate it into their work, including Carolyn Wolf Russell, Bill Collagen, and Gloria Crane. Now you can easily apply metal leaf using Gourdmaster heat activated designer glue. Not only does it dry in seconds using a heat tool, there's also no need to worry about your metal leaf flaking or peeling off, as shown on this gourd which was made using traditional metal leaf liquid adhesives. Gourdmaster heat activated glue bonds so strong you can even scratch it with a fingernail and the metal leaf stays intact. To apply metal leaf, just brush on the glue from the bottle using a paintbrush, then heat the wet glue about 10 to 20 seconds with a heat tool to make it sticky. Lay your metal leaf over your gourd and gently press it down onto the glue using a sponge brush or a soft cloth. Remove the excess metal leaf and you're done. What used to take 20 minutes with traditional metal leaf adhesives is now done in seconds. The heat activated glue holds your metal leaf so strong, you can apply wax or varnish right over the top and it won't rub off. For most projects, you'll want to wood burn a design on your gourd first, before you apply metal leaf. The wood burned lines give your design definition and allow you to easily clean up the edges of your metal leaf after it has been applied. The result is a sharp, professional looking image. Want to apply images to your gourd quickly and easily without the need to wood burn a design first? Now you can using rubber stamps and the glue pad version of heat activated glue. Simply stamp into the glue and apply to your gourd using a gentle rolling motion. Heat activate the glue about 10 seconds and apply your metal leaf. Remove the excess metal leaf using a sponge brush and you're done. It's that simple. Another option is to use Gourdmaster pigment powders instead of metal leaf. Just apply and heat the glue the same way, then using a dry fluffy brush apply a small amount of your chosen colors. With so many incredible colors to choose from, your design options are nearly limitless. Gourdmaster heat activated glue is non-toxic and cleans off your stamps easily with water because it is not sticky until it is heat activated. This means it's easy to correct mistakes. Simply wipe off the wet glue before you heat it and start again. If you make a mistake on a gourd that has ink dye underneath, just wipe off the wet glue and apply more ink dye. Unlike leather dye, Gourdmaster ink dyes blend seamlessly so you can't even see there was a mistake. Once you've heat set your ink dye about 20 seconds, you're ready to re-stamp your image. When your stamp runs out of glue, simply refill it using the glue in the bottle. Not sure whether to use black or clear glue? If you're applying pigment powders, the black glue works best. The colors show up more bold, making them really stand out. The clear glue will not show your colors as strong. If you're using the glue to apply metal leaf, the clear glue works best. Metal leaf acts different than the powders. With the powders, the particles are so fine they cover every square millimeter of the glue, so no glue can show through. The metal leaf, on the other hand, is thicker and heavier than the powders and may not grab to every speck of the glue. If you have black glue underneath, it may show through in some areas. The clear glue, on the other hand, gives you a flawless finish on your metal leaf design. For great tips on wood burning a design, working with Gourdmaster ink dyes, and applying metal leaf, be sure to watch the full-length tutorial, Elegant Gourd Art, with award-winning artist Gloria Crane. Just click on the video tutorials link.